Wait, where'd the baby go? Where is he? Where? What? Where's Gail? I'm so confused. Hey everyone, and welcome back to the Busy Simmers 100 Baby Challenge. Just as a recap, in the last episode we had twins, Gail and Hermione with Mortimer. Triss aged up to young adults, and Frank is currently sleeping, but he's still working on getting his skills up so we can age him up to a child. I did go ahead, I gave Katniss a um, job in the athletic career track, and I invited her over to get a selfie with her and then I did get a selfie with Tris before she left and then I gave her a career in the criminal career track so uh, because she was evil I thought maybe she'd enjoy that I also gave her a house in Oasis Springs so that's fun so I am gonna go ahead and put the pictures next to the birth certificate so there's one of Effie and Tris. Um, so I need to hang up. I need to see if any of the ones with Katniss and Effie are any good. With Tris, two of them had a gnome photo bombing it. So that was kind of funny. I'm gonna see if we can get that again. But I can't believe we only have two kids aged up. That's insane to me. Hermione's really hungry. She's gonna... She's sleeping, but she's gonna, I guess, get taken away. So that's fun. And Frank's starving. So we're starting this day the best <laughs> possible scenario here. Come on, Frank. I just put you to bed, too. Frank is hungry. Where'd you get that? I made this one. I mean, you made it. Did you make me one? Gail is hungry. Hermione is hungry. Oh, no. She'll feed Gail here in a minute. All right, both the babies seem to be OK. Frank's getting his potty skull to level three. These twins are like so demanding let's see we've got movement level three potties almost at level three thinking's at level three so we need let's work on communication because that's another important one gail we're coming oh um so i did make some changes to the house i kind of livened up the kids room i made it into kind of a toddler room with three toddler beds because i don't I mean, we shouldn't need more than three of those, but if we do, we will add more. So I gave them a fun, this tile puzzle piece floor and then just a really colorful wall. Didn't really do much in the kids' study. I might move that anyway. I don't know. We'll see. But I just kind of gave it a little more muted color. It was just really drab. So then I did add a basement. It's really plain right now, but there's three kids' bedrooms. This will actually be the teens' area because teens like to hang out in basements. So there's three teen rooms. Rooms, two bathrooms and then what I oops, what I plan on doing here is adding like a TV room and a study maybe or a yoga studio we'll see yeah I mean there's plenty of room down here I just I totally ran out of money <laughs> We're close to it anyway. We just got paid again, so that's great because our bills are gonna go like way up and that's gonna suck really bad. So <laughs> they're gonna start crying again any second. And then I wanted her to write another book. We can write a biography now. I read a few biographies, not very many. The first biography I ever read was about Garth Brooks in the seventh grade to do a book report on, and that was really interesting. I also read one about BTK, which is the serial killer in. I believe it was in Kansas, Find Torture Kill, and he got away with killing people for like 20 years. I figured we'd go with <laughs> Garth Brooks because that's a little happier than, uh, than a serial killer. I also bought a Garth Brooks kind of biography type book. It's, I think there's a lot of pictures in it. Wow, these kids are demanding. Holy smokes. Hermione, you're killing me. Okay, now she's happy maybe? And then just in time for Effie to write da sit down and write, the uh, Gail's gonna start crying. I can just feel it. Frank's feeling a little neglected, but he can continue with his skill here. I think something's glitching because she just acted like she needed to pee and she doesn't. So something's going on with my game. I don't know. I don't know what's up. We'll just try to keep on top of it anyway. Maybe we can get around to doing this now. I don't know. 
Oh, the other thing I haven't checked in a really long time. Okay, so her satisfaction points aren't going up nearly as fast as I'd like, but she hasn't really done much with writing in the last episode or two. So hopefully we can get there today. That would be awesome. How's Frank doing? He needs to... Ooh, he can babble to the babies. So we'll have him level his communication skill up and then have him talk to the twins. Oh, he can talk now. Great. Come on, Frank. I'm sure talking to the twins will get your uh, skill level up too, so that'll be really good. Oh, we need him to also um, open more presents because Father Winter would not give him a present no matter how many times he asked. Um, well, let's try opening a present. Oh, look at that fun wrapping paper. What'd he get? Flea Market Bubble Bottle. That's, that'll be fun, I guess. So he's just not... Let's have him just come over here and talk. Effie's spotlight is fading. I know, we need to get her book out ASAP. She's pregnant right now with Clement's baby, so... These babies require a lot of attention, so we'll kind of do a couple things we think they want. It's almost Gail's birthday and Hermione's birthday. That's wonderful. I kind of feel bad that he's just sitting there not really getting his skills up. That's not... I don't like that. Her fun's low. So let's... Do a playful painting, just cause. Alright, we may have three sets of toddlers in the house soon, guys, and it's just gonna be a disaster. <laughs> I can feel it. She's done. We're gonna sell to an art gallery. It is a masterpiece. Yes, we want to sell that. I also moved the garden to the front of the house because I felt like I was neglecting it, but I, I'm still neglecting it, so... <laughs> Whatever. Uh, we'll get to it eventually. Probably when it's summer and it actually matters whether or not we water it, so. The one thing I do want to have him do before the snow melts is play with the snow because I have not seen that. I haven't seen it yet. Yay, Frank hit potty level three. All right, Effie, let's put you to sleep because these kids are killer and you're gonna have another one soon. How soon? Let's see. Okay, she just started her second trimester. Frank is tired and dirty. Let's have him just play in the snow. I, wa I really want to see what this looks like. <laughs> and play he can play in a plant too. Let's do that too. Oh. <gasps> <laughs> That's adorable. Now he's feeling playful. Playing in the snow. It's a winter wonderland. Oh. Uh-oh. What are you doing, Frank? What are you doing with that shovel? Alright, let's go to bed. Great reputation. Everyone loves attending social events at Effie House, so it'll be easier to achieve gold level rewards during one. In addition, she'll receive phone calls with exciting opportunities such as attending charity benefit parties, job offers to join new careers with immediate promotions up the ranks, and many more. Should Effie be interested in dating, um, a great reputation can help with that as well. Romantic introductions now have a chance of starting a relationship with heightened romance. That's good news for us. These babies are getting on my nerves. She's done nothing but cuddle you and feed you and change your diaper. Shush. And now they've got a dirty diaper. Let's give them a bubble bath. We haven't done that with Frank yet. I love this, um, oops, the sponge here that she's got. It looks like a frog. Or a bear, maybe. I'm pretty sure it's a frog, though. And now one of the babies is not happy. So, we're is Frank at? Is he hungry? Oh, he's a little hungry, but he'll be fine. Let's keep working on communication. And this one probably needs a feeding and a cuddle and a rock. Frank's happy doing his own thing, which is 100% Frank Castle. He likes being alone. Well, he doesn't like it, but he's definitely a loner. Her needs are actually really good. So let's continue working on our biography here. When is Frank's birthday? We really need to get a move. Um, well, okay, it's the twins' birthdays today, so we can age them up. I want to wait until Frank gets his communication skill up to three, just because, just because it'll be less to manage. But maybe we can age Frank up today, too. Both babies are happy. Frank's happy. He'll be hungry soon. Oh, no. No, no, no. No, she's getting sick. 
Stop. Stop it. Let's change that diaper and then we are going to order medicine. I don't know why it gives us a screen unless they plan on adding different types of medicine to the game because you should just, I mean really, you should just be able to hit order medicine and, and just have it immediately. So when I visited Katniss's apartment, um, I she had two bedrooms, one with a double bed and the other with a twin bed as if she might have children. Well, I took out the twin bed and just put like a home gym. I put a boxing bag and a treadmill since she's act she's an active sim and but I did that all with her own funds, not with Effie's. So that's not cheating, I'm pretty sure. I really want him to get his medication up to level three so I think he can do it before he needs to eat. Yep, he's getting mad now. He's tired and he's hungry but he can do it. The bad thing is that we risk getting him taken away. That's really not good. Maybe we can finish it later. Let's go ahead and have him eat and then we'll level it up later. In the meantime, let's go ahead and just... I'm really afraid that these kids are not... Hermione was first. Wait! No! I wanted to age Hermione up first because she was born first. Wait, where'd the baby go? Where is he? Where? What? Where's Gail? I'm so confused. Okay, um... Pick a number between 1 and 8. That would be 3. Hermione's a charmer. What... happened... to Gail? Oh no. <gasps> oh no. It didn't let me pick his traits. I think because I X'd out of the action. Gail has no traits. He'll just be the one that doesn't count because there were twins anyway and I wanted to try to have one baby from like a hundred babies from a hundred different guys. Because the the challenge itself doesn't really specify it. I mean it says a hundred babies from a hundred different guys so in my head that's saying if you have twins with one guy then one of them does not count. But it doesn't say that specifically. Okay that's cute. Hermione has red hair and Gale has black hair, kind of like a goth. He is more goth baby than anything else, so. His crib disappeared too, so we can't even sell it. That sucks. Okay, oh, I didn't even replace our fridge. I'm afraid that all the stuff in it is gonna be deleted, so let's see. We also got a coffee machine, which is cool. What is this? Duffalo cat. Oh. Oh, because that's because Tris started her criminal career before she left the house. I Well, she didn't start it. She got the job and then she left immediately. Oh, that dress. She's glitching out, but oh my gosh. And her glasses. That is so cute. Aw, little Hermione. You look like a little Hermione. You guys, look at all these babies in our house. Holy smokes. I hope that he can sleep with them playing their games. We'll find out here in a second. Okay, he seems to be sleeping. She actually looks pretty okay. I am gonna have her finish opening the presents because um, the adults get cooler gifts, so more useful gifts. Who would give one large pet poop as a gift? You can fertilize with that though. Effie, that's a good gift. You have a garden, so you should be thankful for that. Let's finish the biography about Garth Brooks. We have three itty bitty toddlers. <gasps> she has the monster pajamas! Oh, she finished her book. She's about to go into her third trimester. That is great. I really wanted to try to pop one out <laughs> this episode and not just have like some boring stuff happen. So, Oh, it's New Year's Eve. Oh my gosh. She needs to do some stuff though. Let's see. She likes... Oh, she needs to make a resolution. So she can do that. We can make a resolution to write a book because that's what we do. No, <laughs> kids are so much work. Even sim children are so much work. They like, they hate me. I have the autonomy off and they still don't want to do what I'm telling them to do. She looks like she's pregnant with twins again, doesn't she? Oh god. <laughs> I really hope not. Let's get him potty trained and then both of you can go to bed. No, you can't be sick. Stop. I know we can get the uh, tea brewer and that the green tea kind of helps, but we're just going to keep doing this. Oh, and then she's going to pass out. Cool. Um, <laughs> whatever. Well, that probably wasn't good for your pregnant belly, but we'll just pretend like nothing happened. <laughs> Look at this cool new fridge and the coffee machine. I drink a lot of coffee in real life, but I don't usually have my sims drink it because they will crash big time. Hermione, she needs food. Bad. So let's just do that 
before anything bad can happen. He's hungry. Let's just feed all the kids while we're thinking about it. And he's probably he's actually okay. We might have to we might have to buy a third iPad for the kiddos. I don't know what happened to the other one for real. Okay, now he's getting hungry. So, let's He's almost done. He can do it. Hermione, you're a smart, smart kid. Let's start building up your skills. Oh, it's springtime. That means the snow's gonna start melting. Oh, oh, okay, he leveled up. Great. Let's have them interact a little bit. She's just like having fun over there. And then we can have Gail babble or talk to... Talk about trucks. And he's got green eyes, I think. I can't tell if they're hazel like his mom's. I really wanna level up Frank in this episode, but... Okay, he's looking pretty good right now. The other two are just playing away on their iPads. Oh, okay, she needs attention. I'm gonna actually have her potty train Gail. And then Frank can come over here and start building his imagination skill. Hermione needs some attention desperately. What else does she need? She doesn't really need much else, so she can... Oh, she needs to go to the bathroom. I'm gonna have Effie practice writing so we can get those satisfaction points. And then I think Hermione can talk to her while she's doing that. I hope she gets a bookworm trait. That would be so perfect. Come over here and babble to your mother. More royalties. Oh, we're getting over 2,000 now, so that's good. And she's building skills while she's doing that, so that's good. Hermione's got all her needs pretty much up, so let's go ahead and she probably still needs mental skill. And she's not hungry, but I will have her use the bathroom one more time um, and then have her sleep. And then hopefully we'll have a baby soon. <laughs> I just love how colorful this room is. That's really cool. It might be overstimulating for, like, real children, <laughs> but... I don't care. These aren't real children, these are pixel children. She's still alright, we'll have her eat before she goes to bed. I really want to age Frank up as well. Just, oh no, something's rotten in here, that sucks. Uh, that's the first time our leftovers have gone bad. I bet it's a ham. Oh no, that's excellent. Okay, the cake is finally spoiled, which means this one... It still has three days left, so... That's pretty good. We'll eat the ham, though. Bar. Oh, she reached parenting skill level 9. That's awesome. Let's see what that's about. Effie is now persuasive, persuasive enough that she always succeeds when influencing a kid to do an action like cleaning dishes. Effie also knows how all of their advice and teaching moments will play out. Okay. She needs some fun, so we will have her paint some... Thing. Let's do classic because that will probably bring the most amount of money at this point. She's in labor. All right, let's get the show on the road. I, ooh, that looks like a twin belly. Hopefully that doesn't interrupt all the react. Oh, she's actually washing a dish. <laughs> That's the first time ever. Let's join her. Um, and who's? Oh, have have we? We haven't. Okay, he's next. This. Oh, this is Clement. So let's have him come with us. <laughs> let's see his reaction. And is he gonna stay with us? Let's see, check in at the front desk. Are you gonna be the one, Clement? Are you gonna accept your responsibility here? Oh, what was that robe? That was nice. Baby girl, who did I say I wanted? <laughs> I want to have, let's see, let's name her Scout from To Kill a Mockingbird. I'm sure I told you guys I wanted something else last in the last video, but uh, you know, whatever. All right, what time? It's 10 p.m. Let's hang up our birth certificate. So we've got Katniss and Triss and Frank and Gail. Hermione, and now Scout. I actually had a cat named Scout, but it wasn't after the character in um, To Kill a Mockingbird. It was at, because he was the first one out of the litter to leave the box, and he was just a really curious cat. He lived to be 15 years old, I believe. Oh, the other kids are up. No. Oh, their energy's fine. How's Frank doing? Oh, he needs to go first. 
Let's do Gale and then Hermione. I guess in the morning we'll get her pregnant again. And then he's not having fun, so we'll have him work on thinking. Okay. Oh, she already used her diaper, so let's let's give her a bubble bath. Nope, not Frank. Not Frank. Hermione. Change the diaper and then cuddle. And Hermione, she's going to go back to bed because she's pretty tired. And how's Frank doing? Frank is 100% right now. And, but she is getting tired. And we can actually put him in the room now, I think. Yeah, I think we can. We're going to try. We're all just hanging out. We're going to keep an eye on Frank, though, because he's chilling. He's just chilling. Wild Frank. Oh no, that's not Frank. That's Gale. <laughs> Told you guys, I am gonna screw up their names so many times. And you all will hate me for it, but whatever. She's getting hungry. How is Gale doing? He's still doing good. Get those skills up, Gale. I feel like our first three babies were like the best children of all time. They hardly ever cried. How you doing, Gale? You're tired. That's okay, let's have you eat, poop, and then go to bed. She is just an absolute monster right now with her hunger, so let's get her up. Oh goodness, all of the things. We need to see if we can start upgrading stuff. Oh, we can! Cool! Maybe we'll work on that a little bit. Alright, Hermione, um, maybe we'll have you and Gale hang out. See, our bills went up. They're not quite a thousand, so that's good. I was afraid they'd be, like, way up there. We do need to invite a man over. Let's do Dominic. Um, I don't think we have any kids with him yet, so let's just make sure. Let's invite him over. Dominic will be right over. While Effie is getting on with Dominic, let's have Hermione build some skills. Does she have enough Okay, let's get Dominic in first, and then we'll lock him in, then potty train Hermione. Alright, let's get the show on the road. I know I say that a lot, but... Husk of single, compliment appearance. Frank's up. He's... ooh. He's not happy. Maybe we'll... okay, now we can have him and Hermione hang out. Oh no, it's almost Frank's birthday! No! This is not good, guys. Baby still seems good. She gets really confident around these guys. First kiss. Alright. Already try for baby? That's amazing. Alright, we've got kids everywhere, so let's try to... His attention is not going up very fast, so we will have him eat some of this. Holy crap, we need to get him his third level of imagination. That's the only one we're missing. It's about halfway there, too, so that's good. And she's tired, so we'll have her go to bed. And little Gale is up. Why is he awake? Probably because his siblings are talking. Baby's just hanging out. I'm sure Scout's hungry. The game's just not telling us because it's stupid. It would be really cool if we could get pictures with the twins together. Please be pregnant. Yay! Let's see. He's like, oh no. What did I just do? Oh. No. Ha! Huh, that was a funny joke, Effie. Stop being stupid. <laughs> oh, Frank's almost done. Oh, he's done! Let's... let's have a birthday. This is more important, Effie. Oh, I did that too fast. Sorry, guys. Pick a number between one and four. The answer is two. Ooh, he's a mental child. Pick a number between one and four. It's four. Pick a number between one and six. It's one. One. Insider. Um, Frank wasn't really an insider, but whatever. Alright, how are your needs, Frank? Need toilet, shower, and sleep. 
take an angry poop. <laughs> That's awesome. Oh, he's gonna sleep downstairs now. Cool. Let's claim that bed. I kind of like um, everything on one level because I can always see everything that's going on, but it's not realistic if we want a big family. Did Dominic leave? Everyone but household members. Okay. Dominic left, so we need to lock that door. She's cleaning dishes now. She must be like, oh, these children. I need a reason to get away from them sometimes, so I'm just gonna clean everything. Alright, Hermione, you're tired, but you need to be potty trained. So, as soon as mom is done, we are gonna potty train you. I think we're gonna end the part here, guys. It's kind of a long one, and not much happens, so I'm sorry, but... Next episode, hopefully, we will have um, Frank age up, maybe. The twins will probably age up baby will definitely age up and we will definitely have another baby i'll think about names <laughs> all right until next time happy swimming